Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we will be talking about something that I believe that all households should have at least some of. All right, and that is the track line. And in today's episode, I'm gonna be sharing with you how to fix a blown bulb like the one I have up here and the advantages that I have, that I feel this system has and why I love it so much. And I highly recommend you guys, you know, putting at least one off in your house. Before we get into that video, uh, a bit of a short word from our sponsors. Hi everyone, it's the Pongo Handyman here. We are gonna be putting some deck, uh, a light that's blown. Water starts flowing out. A rotary, rotary function, hammer drill. And then it will make sense. So you would not have a couch where there's not gonna be any fat. It's really simple, just give it a cut. It should come out. Just slightly. Learn how to crack an egg. Yes, I see epoxy versus epoxy. If you like that tip, do leave a comment, like, share, and subscribe. And of course, I'll see you on the next one. Take care. Now, with that out the way, leave me a like, share, and subscribe, and we'll get straight into it. All right. Um, so, as you might notice, this uh, track light is blown. So. Once again, before we start work, switch off everything at the, uh, at the circuit breaker, all the wall switches at least. Okay, so these things are really simple mechanisms, okay? And to change a bulb, you know, sometimes you can change the light bulb that comes in uh, with the track light, and sometimes it's a whole component. So if you find, you know, uh, if I remove this, and, you know, it can't come off, it's stuck it's one piece and there's not a bulb that you could take off probably you need to change the entire uh, the entire fitting so we've got the faulty track light right here and what you got to do is sometimes it's a clip sometimes there's a you know a dial or something but in essence what you want to do is just twist it off the track the track is actually two electrical wires which run along the ceiling and all you got to do is lift it and turn that's it you've got the whole uh, assembly out and you know, I've got a new one right here, okay? And what you gotta do is put it in, and you turn it. There you go. It clips right into place. And you've got a new track light right here. So a lot of my clients say, oh, I don't like track lights, because when they think of track lights, they think of these spotlights which are shining onto their guests or onto wherever they are. But I have a handy little tip. What you should do with a track light is not to direct the beam straight at your seating area, but to bounce it off a wall. So like what I have here, I'm going to bounce it off a wall, and in that way, it fills the room with a more ambient, softer light. And it does not, you know, blind you like uh, a car coming on expressway with high beams, right? So yeah, bounce it off the wall. You know, you can put up to eight, uh, depending on the length of your, of your track. And yeah, use it to light up paintings, you know, uh, can illuminate the ceiling to give, you know, different patterns. And that is pretty cool. But that's not the only thing that a track light can do. Now you check this out. Now, when people think of track lights, they think of these spotlight things. But that's not the only thing that can go up on the track. Let me show you. These are light bulb connectors. Right? And they accept a standard light bulb, which you guys could just, you know, put in like that. There you go. And, you know, you're not just limited to these globes, right? Um, you could get these spaceship looking ones. Like that. Or these more decorative ones that could get off, uh, I don't know, um, Shopee, AliExpress, and there you go. You could put so many things up on the track light. And maybe you say, no, I don't like the spotlight or I don't like the light bulb. There's more. They even have connectors for pendant lights. So you could put a nice lampshade, you know, on, on your track light and change it uh, as you feel, uh, you know, as your taste change, so you're not stuck to having a permanent light fixture drilled to your ceiling, you could swap it up, 
as you like you know you could even have a mix like i have uh, some spotlights right there and i have a pendant light right here you know whatever and the best thing is these things are paintable you could paint them into different colors you have black you have white some people even go gold or green no it's so versatile for your home and it's so easy to change it's so easy to maintain and they are not expensive to buy at all if you like that tip do give me a thumbs up like share and subscribe you know i leave, uh, leave a comment i respond to all your comments and yeah check up here for more videos like this below for a list of all my other videos until next time take care